everybody, it's Sebak7 and welcome back to more Ocarina of Time 3D. So, um, in the last episode, we finally made our way to Iral Castle and we reassembled the uh, free spiritual stones. And yeah, so we were in our way to, to the castle and we saw Princess Zelda with Impa running away from Ganondorf. And yeah, ba basically, we saw the vision that Link had right at the beginning of the game. So, yeah, that thing really happened. And um, yeah, we were. We we saw what happened, that thing, and Zelda threw the Ocarina of Time when she was running away from Ganondorf. And yeah, we have we then got the Ocarina, we played the, the Song of Time, we opened the Door of Time, we re reassembled the three spiritual stones, and yeah, we obtained the Master Sword. And as a result, we kind of, uh, we were trapped in the Sacred Realm, so yeah, for seven years, and yeah, Link is kinda grown up now, but Ganondorf became like a king of evil or something. So yeah, it seems that he, he got his hands on the Triforce. So um, yeah, we'll have to stop him. And for that we'll need to reunite the power of the six sages with some kind of medallions. And yeah, we already got one, the light medallion from Uraru, one of the sages. And yeah, we need to find the other five sages. So, yeah, right now I'm exploring Lon Lon Ranch trying to find uh, something useful. But after that, we'll need to get to Kakuriko Village in order to get some kind of item that someone called Sheka told us about. And yeah, I don't really know what kind of that item it's gonna be, but we'll see about it. And then we'll need to get to the forest temple. So here we go, it seems we got Malan here, she's grown up too. Oh, a visitor! It's been a long time since we had a visitor here. Where did you come from? Since Ganondorf came, people in the castle town have gone. Places have been ruined and monsters are wandering everywhere. Mr. Ingo is just using the ranch to gain Ganondorf's favor. Everyone seems to be turning evil. But Dad, he was kicked out of by the of the ranch by Mr. Ingo. If I disobey, Mr. Ingo will treat the horse so badly. So there's nothing I can do. If only I could play their favorite song for them. Hmm. Well, that's really bad. So Ingo took up the place. Talon is not here anymore, and Melon can't run away from him. It seems so. But she told us about playing a song. So maybe we'll have to play a bonus song? We'll see about it. Oh, and there's Ingo. Whoa, the guy... Well, he changed his clothes. Yeah, he looks like the guy has a lot of cash now, a lot of money. Anyway, there are some people in Kakariko spreading rumors that I cheated Talon out of the ranch, but... Don't be ridiculous. That guy Talon was weak. I, the hard-working Ingo, poured so much in er energy into this place. I don't want any strangers like you saying anything bad about me. Listen, the great Ganondorf recognized my obvious talents and gave the wrench to me. I will raise a fine horse and win recognition from the great Ganondorf. Say, young man, do you want to ride one of my horses? Hmm, yeah, let's try it. But yeah, let's see how we ride. So, approach the horse quietly, mm-hmm. Hey, alright. Mm -hmm. Okay. Alright, so I think I got it. Okay. So. Oh man, there's a timer. The guy looks really greedy. Oh, and there's Epona. Wait a second, so let's try to play the Epona song as Malin told us. Maybe that will do something. Here we go, guys. Let's see what happens. Well, it seems Epona reacted to the song, so yeah. We can ride her now. Oh, okay. Cool. And can we jump over the fences? Oh, yes, we can. Alright, great. Let's see if... Oh, there's Ingo. Let's see if we can talk to him. When you want to dismount, stop and press A. 
Hey young man, do you... I know you. I just felt as I though I've seen you somewhere before. If you use L-targeting, you can talk to me from Orc's back. Are you ready to want... No, I don't know. I want to write. <laughs> okay. Okay, I know it. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Come on! Okay. Okay. Here we go. Let's see if we can jump over this big one. No, we can't. Or maybe we can, but we need to run a little more. So yeah, it seems he's gonna kick us out of here. Yeah. I don't know, but I guess that we can ride a bonus somehow out of the ranch. Hmm, how can we do it? Let me try to figure this out, guys. No. Let's try it once again. There's gotta be a way to get Epona out of here. I'm pretty sure about it. Yeah, so let's play the Epona song once again. Here we go. Yeah, I really want to get... Actually, I never got so far in the game, you know. I, I told you before, I played the game like... 7-8 years ago, something like that, but yeah, I never reached this far in the game, so I'm kind of blind from now on, guys. Uh, yeah, so I'm trying to figure this out. Let's see if we can talk to him. You're getting better. How about a little race with me? One lap around the coral with that horse. Oh, yeah! So maybe we can win the race and get Epona out of here? I don't know. We'll see, guys. Okay, here we go. We're doing great so far. And I guess we did it. Yep, we did it, guys. Shoot! If the great Ganondorf found out about this humiliation... Hey you, how about another race? If you win, you can keep the yours. Hmm, it seems so that's the way to get a Pona. Let's see about it, guys. Here we go, let's try it once again. Here we go, here we go, we close now. And we did it. We did it, guys. Let's see if we can get Epona out of here. What's up with that horse? Is that Epona? How did you tame that wild horse right under my nose? I was going to present that horse to the great Ganondorf, but I bet it on the race and lost. Shoot. <laughs> As I promised, I'll give you the horse to you. However... I'll never let you leave this ranch. Oh man, this guy's really... I don't know how he became the owner of Lumon. I don't even know how he managed to get uh, to kick out Talon out of here. So yeah, the guy's really... Uh, yeah, he's, he's really a jerk. But anyway, how can we get out of here? So he closed the doors. Hmm. Can we... Oh yeah, we can jump over this fence. And we did it! I guess we have a Pona now! Yeah guys, we did it! We can ride a Pona now, that's great! So yeah, I never I never got this far into the game, I'm really happy! I could figure this out like this! So yeah, really great! I, I guess the first time I've played this, I, I... Where did I end up? Actually, I guess I got the Master Sword and I didn't play the game after that, yeah! But anyway, so we have now a Pona, and let me see, where are we? So that's Lon Lon Run. Death Mountain is over there. So, yeah, oh, okay, I get it. So, right now we're just trying to head to Kakuroko Village. 
And yeah, let's see if we can get that item that Shaker told us about. But yeah, that's really great. So I have now a pawn. I guess that will be really useful to yeah to get around on in Iroll, you know. So yeah, we can't jump over this. We really need to cross the bridge. But yeah, really cool. So I guess that you can ride Epona by playing the Epona song, I guess, and she'll come to you. We'll see about it later on. But anyway, let me just get out of here, alright? And let's head to Kakiruko Village. So, let me see, is there anything new? Here. Actually, everything seems pretty much the same. Oh, wait a second. Is that some kind of store or something? I don't know. Actually, I'll better play the um, the the um, sun, uh, the song sun maybe, and see if there's something useful. So yeah, let me just play the song sun see if there's someone around here because yeah you know it's night and no one's around so let me just let me just play the sun song see if we can okay so now it's day let's check out if there's somebody and yeah, there's... Oh, wait, these two folks looks like the ones that were in Iroh Castle Market. It seems so. So maybe the people that were in Iroh Castle Market, or Iroh Castle Town, are around here now? Maybe? Maybe the people moved on to here to escape Ganondorf's destruction? I don't know. Whoa, who is that? Hmm, I don't know what kind of things you want, but anyway. So... Let me see if there's anything useful around. Maybe not. Oh, let's see this guy. What you got to tell us? Whoa, whoa. Oh man, I shouldn't have done that. But yeah, it seems the stores... Yeah, this is... Yeah, it seems the stores got here now. So yeah, this is a bazaar. So yeah, the guys from... From Iroh moved here. So yeah, from Iroh Town, they, they're here now. So yeah. Okay. That's a good thing to know. So actually, we got all the stores we had in the market right here now. At least it seems so. And this is the potion shop, I guess. The potion, yeah. So I don't need any potion, but right now we can get back here. We couldn't when we were just a kid. Well, I managed to get here by using um, a chicken. I don't know if you guys you remember a cuckoo, but yeah. Uh, actually, we couldn't get past through the um, potion shop, and and yeah, there's another one here. Hmm. I heard that the Lost Woods where fairies live is a strange place with many mysterious smells. I wish I could just once make medicine with some of the strange things I might find there. Hmm. Okay, I don't know if this la- Wait! Isn't that the lady the old guy in Lake Ilya told us about? I think so. But anyway. Maybe th this will all be related somehow in the future with some kind of side quest. But yeah, so so yeah, the guy told us that there the, the two guys that were laughing told us there was Drampe, the the grave the the gravekeeper that he, he became a ghost somehow and was holding a treasure. Is that the thing we were looking for? I guess we'll have to to head to the graveyard and fight about it. But anyway, I read a new type of miniature cuckoo. I call it the pocket cuckoo. I don't get goosebumps from this baby. Cuckoos are very good at, la at getting lazy late risers out of bed. Haven't you heard of them before? Hmm.
So we got a pocket egg, and the pocket cuckoo should get out of it. And yeah, there's this old man. So, mm hmm. An eye of truth. Now, usually you have to train your mind's eye most strenuously to actually see the truth. But this fella, no. They said he had a different way of doing things. Hmm, okay. Let me see the house of Skultula. See if I can get something from here now. Cause I got a lot of, of golden tokens now, so let's see. So yeah, I have 17 golden tokens, let's see if there- Oh, there's someone here! And we can now carry 200 rupees, that's great! So good thing I came inside here. So yeah, I have 17 golden tokens, I managed to get a, a bigger wallet now, an adult wallet. So let me see, what else can we, could we do here? So, uh, so we got a pocket egg, what else can, oh, let me see, what is this? Um, uh, maybe? Let's see. Oh, okay, so we have now a bowl. Oh, so this is kind of a mini game, uh, similar to to the one with the slingshot. Oh man, I missed this too. Yeah, so I got eight. Yeah, maybe we can get something by by getting all of them. We'll see about it. No! Oh man, I missed this too once again. That's annoying. So he's giving me one more time. Here we go. So I have another try, let's see if I manage to do this. I don't know if we're gonna get some prize by winning. Here we go. Yes. Alright, almost there, guys. We did it! So, 50 rupees, that's great. Cause, uh, yeah, now that I have the big wallet, the adult wallet, it's really great to get all the that rupees. So, yeah, they told us about... Let me see just the windmill before I keep moving, but yeah, I guess that we'll have to go to the graveyard. There we go, so we're in the windmill right now. Oh, what happened to the guy? It seems he's... Whoa, he's kind of angry. I'll never forget what happened on that day seven years ago. It's all that Hokarina kid falls. Next time he comes around here, I'm gonna mess him up. Oh, really? But I'm the one with our ocarina, I don't remember playing a song for you. Let me see. What? You got an ocarina? What the heck? That reminds me of that time seven years ago. Back then a mean kid came here and played a strange song. He messed up this windmill. Hmm, let's play the song guys. This gotta be the Song of Storms, I think. Yeah, it is! It's the Song of Storms. And we got another music for our ocarina, another song. But that's strange, what will he tell... Why, why will he tell us about 7 years ago and playing this music? We never played this music 7 years ago. I don't know, maybe... We'll, will we have to play this music later on? Uh, and get back in time somehow? I don't know, that's kinda, yeah, that's kinda strange. But yeah, there was the art container right there, but I can't get there from uh, for now. So, uh, 
I don't know if I'm I forgot exploring somewhere else. Is there something else I should explore around here? Wait a, wait a second, did I get inside this house here? No, I think not. Let me see. Oh, people have hardships in their past that they would rather no one found out about. Look at that beard man over there. I bet even someone like him has had his share of troubles in the past. Look at him, the man with the beard. I think he was fired from his job at the ranch. Oh, don't tell me, that's... Talon? Yeah, he's right here, sleeping. Hmm. Wait a second. Maybe we could wake him up once again like we did in the past by using the cuckoo? Okay, I think I got this, guys. We need to... To play the... The sun song so the cuckoo can hatch from its egg. Let's try it. So right now it's night. Let me just get out of the house, because I don't know we need to be inside the house or outside so we can have some kind of sun. Here we go. Oh. Here we go, so... Yeah, I guess that after that we'll be done with all the kind of side quests around the place here. I don't know. So yeah, we got the cuckoo now. And yeah, let's use it. Here we go. So... Let me assign some items here. Here we go. Okay, so that should be it for now. And yeah, let's use the cuckoo. What in damnation! Can a person get a little sad eye around here? Did you save Malin? Thanks! I'm going back to the ranch then. Hee ha! So yeah, we walk with Taylor and yeah, it seems he's going back to Lolan Ranch. So yeah, I guess that it's time enough for Ingo to be being kicked out of the place, you know. Yeah, so we done here. Let's just give her back the cuckoo. Your cuckoo looks pretty happy. You must have awakened an extremely a lazy guy. You're a good cuckoo keeper. I'll give you a rare, valuable cuckoo if you're interested. His name is Kojiro, and it used to be my brother's cuckoo. Its blue body is quite charming. It's so cute. Since my brother has gone, it's strange, but Kojiro has stopped crowing. You want to keep Kojiro? Yes. We returned the pocket cuckoo and got Kojiro in return. Unlike the other cuckoos, Kojiro rarely recovers. Take Kojiro to the location marked with an arrow on the maps. Hmm, okay. So this gotta be some kind of side quest, but anyway, we got Kojiro now. So yeah, really good that I've been walking around doing all this stuff. It seems that it's really useful. But yeah, let's keep on moving and we'll go to the graveyard now. What do you want, nothing? What do you want? Should we believe what Shake said and go to Kik Oh, we're in Kakiroko Village. What are you talking about? <laughs> okay, guys. So, um, I don't know. I guess we'll have to find Jompe or at least his ghost, as the, those guys told us about. Because it seems he's got some kind of treasure. Let me see if there's actually something around here. Yeah, it seems he's really dead, so... Yeah, I guess we're gonna explore the graveyard, see if we can find a Dompe, or at least his ghost, and see if we can get that treasure that those guys told us about. Because I guess that's the item that Sheikah mentioned, and that we're gonna have to use to get access to the forest temple. So we'll see that in the next episode. And yeah, that's gonna be it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like the video, leave me all your comments in the comment section below. And yeah, you can also follow me on Twitter, like me on Facebook. All the links are going to be in the description. So once again, thanks for watching guys. And I'll see you in the next episode of Ocarina of Time 3D. See ya.